Hello friends, today I'm going to work on 2nd grade Megra Hill Mind Math Volume 1 Homework Book. Today's focus is on Chapter 1, Lesson 2. Count on to add. Explore and explain. Wow, I am longer than I thought. Teacher directions. Draw a green box around number one. Count on three. One, two, three. Draw a purple box around that number. Draw a green box around number seven. Count on two. Draw a purple box around that number. Nine. Draw a green box around number 11. Count on one. Draw a purple box around that number. 11, 12. See and show. Find 7 plus 3. Use a number line. Count on to add. Start with the greater add end. Start at 7. Count on 3. So we start at 7 and we count on 3. 1, 2, 3. We land on 10. So the answer is 10. 7 plus 3 is 10. 7 plus 3 equals to 10. 10 equals to 7 plus 3. Count on to add. Use the number line to help. 6 plus 3. So we start with the greater add end and count on 3. 1, 2, 3. 9 because we landed on 9. 6 plus 3 is 9. Question number 2. Blank equals to 4 plus 2. Start at the greater number, which is 4, and count on 2. 1, 2. We land on 6, so the answer is 6. Question number 3. 2 plus 9. We start with the greater add end, 9. Then we add 2. 1, 2. 2 plus 9 is 11. So 11 is the answer. Question number four. One plus three. The greater add end is three. So we start at three and count on one. One. The answer is four because we landed on it. So one plus three is four. Question number five. Blank equals to two plus seven. 7 is the greater add end, so let's start at 7. Then we count on 2. 1, 2. So 7 plus 2 is 9 because we landed on 9. Question number 6. Blank equals to 9 plus 1. 9 is the greater add end, so let's start at it. Now let's count on 1. 9 plus 1 is 10. Because we landed on 10, 10 is the answer. Talk math. Why should you count on from the greater add end? The reason why we start at the greater add end is because we count on fewer numbers. If we start at the smaller add end, we will need to count on more. On my own. Count on to add. Use the number line to help. Helpful hint. Start with the greater add end. Question number seven. Seven plus one equal to blank. So we start at the greater add end, seven. And we count on one. So seven plus one is eight. Question number eight. Blank equals to 5 plus 2. 
5 is the greater add end, so we start at 5 and count on 2. 1, 2. Because we landed at 7, 7 is our answer. Question number 9. 3 plus 8. Because 8 is the greater add end, we'll start at 8 and count on 3. 1, 2, 3. Because we landed on 11, 11 will be our answer. Question number 10. 6 plus 1. Because 6 is the greater add end, we'll start at 6 and count on 1. Because I landed on 7, 7 will be my answer. Question number 11. Blank equals to 9 plus 3. Because 9 is the greater and end, let's start at it and add on 3. 1, 2, 3. Because we landed on 12, 12 will be our answer. Question number 12. 2 plus 8. Because 8 is the greater add end, we'll start at 8 and count on 2. 1, 2. So 8 plus 2 is 10. Question number 13. 2 plus 7. Because 7 is the greater add end, let's start at 7. And add on 2. 1, 2. Because we landed on 9, 9 will be our answer. Question number 14. 3 plus 2. Start at 3 and count on 2. 1, 2. So 3 plus 2 is 5. Question number 15. 1 plus 9. Let's start at 9 and count on 1. 1. 10. So 10 is our answer. Question number 16. 5 plus 1. 5. Start at 5 and count on 1. 6. So 6 is our answer. Question number 17. 3 plus 6. Let's start at 6 and count on 3. 1, 2, 3. 9. So 3 plus 6 is 9. Question number 18. 1 plus 4. Because 4 is our greater add end, let's start at 4. And count on 1. 5. So 5 is our answer. So 4 plus 1 is 5. Question number 19. 3 plus 1. Because 3 is the greater add end, let's start at 3. And count on 1. 4. So 3 plus 1 is 4. Question number 20. 2 plus 6. Let's start at 6 and count on 2. 1, 2. So 2 plus 6 is 8. Question number 21. 8 plus 1. Let's start at 8 and add on 1. 9. So 8 plus 1 is 9. Problem solving. Question number 22. Annie buys 6 eggs at the market. She has 3 more eggs at home. How many eggs does she have in all? So 6 plus 3. Plus 3 equals to 9. So 9 eggs. Sal's cow gave 3 pails of milk in the morning and 5 pails in the afternoon. How many pails of milk did Sal's cow give? So 3 plus 5 or 5 plus 3. And 5 plus 3 equals to 8. So, Sal's cow gave 8 pails. Question number 24. Joseph has 4 pigs on his farm. One pig has 3 piglets. How many pigs are on the farm? So, 4 plus 3. And 4 plus 3 equals to 7. 
So Joseph has seven pigs on his farm. Write math. How does counting on help you add? Counting on on the number line is nothing but adding two numbers. My homework. Use a number line to find nine plus three. Start with the greater add and count on to add. So nine, and we count on three. One, two, three. So nine plus three equals to twelve. Practice. Count on to add. Use the number line above. So four plus one, four, and count on one, five. So five is our answer. Question number two. Two plus six. Start on six and count on two. One, two, eight. So eight is our answer. Question number three. One plus eight. Start on eight and count on one. Nine. So nine is our answer. Question number four. Three plus six. We start on six and count on three. One, two, three, nine. So nine is our answer. Question number five. Two plus four. We start on four and count on two. One, two. Six. So our answer is six. Question number six. Two plus eight. Start on eight and count on two. One, two. Ten. So our answer is ten. Question number seven. Three plus nine. Start on nine and count on three. One, two, three. Twelve. So twelve is our answer. Question number eight. Four plus three. Start on four and count on three. One, two, three. Seven. So seven is our answer. Question number nine. One plus four. Start on four and count on one. One. Five. So five is our answer. Read, and then solve the problems. Question number ten: Six bees are buzzing near a hive. Three more bees come out of the hive. How many bees are there now? So, six plus three equals to nine. So, nine bees are there now. Question number eleven. Cherry has five trading cards. She gets three more cards. How many cards does Cherry have now? So, five plus three equals two eight. So, Cherry has eight cards. There are eight butterflies on a bush. Three more butterflies fly onto the bush. How many butterflies are on the bush now? So, eight plus three equals to eleven. So, eleven butterflies are on the bush now. Vocabulary check. Draw lines to match. Thirteen count on. Fourteen add end. Thirteen is counting on on a number line, and fourteen is six plus three equal to nine, because six and three are add ends. I hope you learned how to count on the number line to add two numbers. Thank you for watching our videos. Bye.